Hello and welcome. Today we are going to try an experimental tool from Google Labs called Whisk. This is an application of AI for working with images. So you can see the link here. When you go to the link and log in with your Google account, this is the first page that we see. We can add an image and see what it does here itself. But let's go to start from scratch. Now on this page, uh, if you click here, you can select a preset that you want to start with. So I'm going to start with the sticker. And you can also choose aspect ratio. Default is landscape. We can do square or portrait. So I'm going to keep this as landscape. So once you go here, you'll see that there are three things, subject, scene, and style. For style, I have already selected sticker that appears here. And now either we can enter a text for the subject or upload image. So I'm going to upload one image. So let's try this. And then we can add a scene or if you are ready to go, you can just hit this button and it will try to create a sticker based on that picture. So once you have this sticker, you can also like uh, go and refine by adding anything here. You can also see the prompt. So you can edit the prompt itself. So let's change color from green to maybe pink. So change t-shirt color to pink. And then you can see color of the t-shirt now is pink. If you like to add a scene, you can again upload a picture or enter text. So I'm going to enter text here near a beach and then hit this button. Typically it produces two pictures, but sometimes it may do just one. So you can see a scene from beach is added behind the sticker. So I'm going to delete these and use some other image. Okay, let's try this image. So once it analyzes and accepts the image, another thing you can do is click on this button and it will add some default scenes. So for example, if you want to take a look at what is the prompt for this style, so you can see details about the prompt. Once you click on this link, it will try to generate two images by merging those ideas from subject, scene, and style. You can see it tries merging those three ideas. So let's try this. And then we add some seen here this scene is imagine a ski resort in swiss alps and this is uh, not from snow and ice but from cheeses and so on so let's try this so let me change the style to something else so i will delete this add some more options and hit go button so we get this picture so this scene is the air is cool and carries a scent of brine and something else and so on. So let me try this. Eating ice cream. And then suddenly you see ice cream in the picture. So because we have eating ice cream, so obviously every picture you see, the subjects are eating ice cream. So we have this subject and then a scene and a style. And you see these two images. Now for the scene, let's say near mountains. So you get this scene. So we get this picture near mountains. Now instead of uh, mountains, if I say big city, it generates a similar image in a big city now. So basically this is an interesting uh, generative AI where you can generate new images by working with a subject, scene and style. So something interesting to explore by Google Labs. 
Let's see how it develops as they take it forward, but certainly something uh, worth exploring. Thanks for watching. See you soon.